Halloween is 31 days away and children and adults are gearing up for their favorite holiday of the year. Fox News Stephanie Rothman giving us into the spirit at the opening of a haunted house in St. Peter's. All this is set up to scare as many people as possible, and let me tell you, they did. I could not even walk through it. My photographer, Wyatt, behind the lens right now, he was the one that had to go through, and he told me it's pretty scary. So if you're looking for a haunted house, this is definitely one of them to kickstart your time getting scared this season. What are you doing? Witches. Ah! Ah! Tortured souls. <laughs> clowns oh my looks like Halloween is around the corner and people are lined up to be scared by all and you're not scared I'm scared a little bit families at the opening of fear the haunted house in St. Peter's getting their spooky fix at any cost oh, if anybody needs sacrificing it's her that's and, true. Then, and then she's the one that's gonna carry me but it's not just the haunted houses that have opened their doors Year-round Halloween store, Johnny Brox is seeing an uptick as the season officially kicks off. A lot of people are shopping early. A lot of people are coming in a lot earlier, and thank goodness we actually have more supply. Uh, last year, there was a little bit of supply uh, issue, but we don't have that this year. This is the first year they've been back to normal, comfortably meeting the high demand of their customers since the start of the pandemic. New inventory, a lot of the stuff we got in new stuff. Uh, new products, new jackets and things like that. So we're excited. Sales are up 7% and October hasn't even begun. I also have skeletons hanging on my house and I bought the 12 foot mummy skeleton. So I'm gonna put that up sometime soon. I'm super excited for Halloween. I love it. That special place in St. Louisans hard for Halloween growing as fast as the costumes for it fly off the shelves. The Haunted House will be open every Friday and Saturday night from 7 to 11. If you want your kids to go, it's going to be $15. And for adults, it's $20. And from what I'm told, it's plenty worth it. Reporting in St. Peter's and a terrifying St. Peter's, Stephanie Rothman, Fox 2 News.